this morning I'm out on the farm. As soon as I got to uh, Front Porch Pets, uh, we got a phone call that uh, for certain a neighbor's dog had killed some turkeys and some chickens. And uh, I'm seeing here is where the fence, the electric fence was uh, likely torn up and the animal, the dogs got in under the fence here and killed a couple turkeys, which I'm sure has them all a bit traumatized. And uh, Chef David is on the phone with the, the neighbor, just uh, negotiating that. That's part of farm life. But it's also important that no matter uh, who the dog owner is and where you live, that your dogs are contained. Because, you know, dogs do things that are inappropriate sometimes. Oh look, I've got people following me. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's, it's unfortunate. Yesterday when I got uh, here to the farm, first thing in the morning, I did find a, a dead turkey. Uh, that had just been killed, thinking that potentially it was a fox, but now we know that indeed it was the neighbor's dogs. So, anyway, that's part of farm life, and that's uh, part of the life on uh, the Front Porch Pets Farm. But uh, it's the kind of thing where the, the neighbor needs to reimburse Front Porch Pets for the carnage that happened, apparently. This morning, two turkeys and a couple chickens were were killed. So, anyway, that's that's kind of our our morning drama here at the Front Porch Pets Farm. And hopefully, the rest of the day will be much better and much brighter because because uh, we're in the kitchen making dog treats and designing cool things for your pets. You know, she rescues dogs, but she doesn't know anything about the breeds. And, uh, you know, so I just tried to coach her that, you know, she needs to understand the breeds that she's bringing into her yard. Yeah. Because they all have, they're working dogs. And you can't blame them for coming over here. This is, if for nothing else, it's fun <laughs> for a dog, right? Um, they get to practice their hunting skills and, um, if I was a dog, I'd be over here running around. So, anyway, I'm not going to call the sheriff on her today, but I told her in the future there will be a call. And she's going to get a, you know, some sort of a um, shelter to keep them in over there, a kennel and, and whatnot. And so we'll see what happens.